Well, hello, 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 everyone out there in Tarot Land. This is your girl, Zingaya, the Zen Libran, and welcome to my channel, Journeys with the Narcissist. Here on my channel, I pull from the feminine energy that has went through a lot of trials and tribulations with narcissists, and I tell their story through tarot. So thank you for joining me, guys. And of course, this is the Goddess Channel, and I pull from the feminine energy. Um, I feel we need more feminine energy out here today to uh, balance this world um, and bring it out of darkness, um, the darkness that the patriarch has put it in. So we need the matriarchal uh, energy out here, um, the true rulers, the original rulers that were designed to rule this planet, to bring light, to govern, to counsel this planet. And the world is in darkness because it's not being ruled by the original rulers. So we need to elevate ourselves, ladies. We are the original healers, and we need to heal ourselves, put the focus on ourselves, worry about ourselves, and elevate ourselves because Mother Earth is crying out. She needs us. She needs all of her divine feminines, and we have the and we're rising, and we have these narcissists arising too, um, and they're up against us. They want to fight us. They want to keep us down because they do not want this world to be out of darkness. Okay, all right, guys. Um, I hope everybody's doing well. Um, I'm Zen as usual, and I'm here for you guys to do a general collective reading for the zodiac sign of Virgo. Virgo, my helper, my strong helper, earth energy, all right, um, very business-minded uh, oriented, okay, um, has standards and will stick by them, uh, especially uh, a feminine, <laughs> uh, a female, she has standards and a Virgo is one of the signs that won't uh, bring down her standards for anybody. She would rather be by herself than to lower her standards. You see, she's sitting there with her legs closed, closed to intimacy, you know, closed to feelings and intimacy, because if you don't meet her standards, she would rather be by herself, you know, um, very helpful. Um, a Virgo always wants to help to make things right. Um, I will say that they are a pessimist, because they look at life, they look at things like, how can I fix this? So they try to pull the problems out of things. Instead of, hmm, let me see, a Libra. A Libra looks at the beauty in things. So a Libra is optimistic and a Virgo is pessimistic. But a Virgo is that way because they're meant to fix things. So they analyze everything to see how they could be fixed. Very analytical, very analytical. That's my Virgo. Loyal to the end. I mean, they can come out judge, come off opinion, opinionated or judgmental, but that's just a Virgo because they want everything to be right. All right? That's my Virgo. Okay? And, of course, guys, like I said, this is the Goddess Channel, and I pull from the feminine energy. And the feminine en energy that I pull today to help me deliver this message for Virgo is Katesh. Katesh is here giving us the energy of sacred lust. <laughs> we have a feminine here that has plenty suitors, and they're lusting after her. You have some that are lusting after her to just be a, a true uh, um, Jupiter to her, to take care of her, to provide and spoil her. But then you have others that are just lusting off of her, off of her, um, after her for sex. You know, she's very voluptuous, uh, hippie, uh, not a skinny woman at all, you know, a uh, full-figured woman, and everybody wants to get with her. You know what I'm saying? That's Katesh, giving us the energy of sacred lust. All right, guys. <clears throat> What's going on out here in the ethers for my Virgo? What's going on out here in the ethers for my Virgo? What's going on is, it's good times ahead. It's good times ahead coming for my Virgo, for Virgo energy. It's the Virgo energy here. Um, it's good times coming ahead. 
you know, um, your hard times have come to an end. Um, if you were going through unemployment, um, renew your faith because you're going to recover from financial ruin. You know, your luck is improving. Um, you're going to be welcomed by a lot of people. All of your debts are going to be repaid. And, you know, this is a light at the end of a tunnel. You know, um, it's going to happen for you. So be happy. And what's going to happen is it's going to be your occupation. Whatever you're doing, whatever your job is, is going to take off. You know what I'm saying? It's going to take off. And it's going to be lucrative uh, for you financially. You're going to be able to pay off all your debts, be debt free. You know what I'm saying? Um, your luck is improving and all your hard times are coming to an end. You know, um, you could have a new job offer. You're going to be offered a new job. You know what I'm saying? It's happening for you, girl. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Good times ahead. You know what I'm saying? See, you done been through a lot. You done been through a lot. And you, these lessons have schooled you dearly. They done schooled your ass. You done learned a lot in your life. A hell of a lot. That has made you go to another level. You know what I'm saying? You have been initiated. You have the rite of passage because you learned all the uh, lessons that you needed to learn in your waking life at this particular point in time. Yeah. You've been to school. You know what I'm saying? See, it's it's uh, blessings and stressing. You know what I'm saying? People want to take things the easy way. Uh, like I was telling my guy <clears throat> earlier, um, shortcuts would, would always get you, you know what I'm saying? You miss, you're missing your lesson if you try to take the shortcut. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, you know what I'm saying? Take the right path and take your time. You know what I'm saying? And get seasoned. You know what I'm saying? And um, you won't have to worry about uh, uh, getting snagged, you know, going the wrong way. You know, stay on the path. Stop trying to take a shortcut. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, because you know this feminine knows that certain things are meant to happen at certain particular times. You know what I'm saying? And that's how destiny works. You know, uh, no matter how much pressure you may feel from the outside world, uh, you know what I'm saying? There's a there's an order of events. You know what I'm saying? And um, divine timing is in place. You know what I'm saying? So what is meant to be is going to be. You know what I'm saying? What shall be, shall be. You know what I'm saying? So you, this is divine timing for this feminine now. All of her dreams are coming true. You know what I'm saying? She put in that work. You know what I'm saying? This is her territory. You know what I'm saying? She put in that work. You know, and uh, she deserves this. This is her time. You know what I'm saying? And the universe is smiling down on her. You know what I'm saying? She's a uh, her look is changing financially in her in her job field, and also she has plenty of suitors. Plenty of suitors. You know, she has so many people coming after her. She has so many uh, possibilities. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this girl is uh, on the one. You know what I'm saying? This girl is on the one. You know, uh, she could have a pick of the litter. Whoever she wants to be in a relationship with, whoever she wants to have a foundation with, you know what I'm saying? She got her gate closed. You know what I'm saying? And she's not letting nobody in unless they're worthy. Okay, unless they're worthy, she's not going to be bothered with them. So she has a pick of the litter who she wants to be in the partnership with. You know what I'm saying? Um, she's got a lot of uh, healthier and happier choices at hand. Yeah, you know, um, she has a lot of options. You know what I'm saying? A lot of options to be happy. And she's like, hmm, let me think. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Everybody wants to be with her because she's a white witch. She is a witch of the light. She has this young, youthful spirit about herself, and she's very wise. She is the light. She brings the light to everyone that she touches. Yeah. So everybody wants to be with her, you know, but she's not a fool. You know what I'm saying? She's that Virgo, you know, and what Virgos do, they keep them legs closed. They closed off to intimacy and feelings unless you're worthy. You know, she knows her self-worth, but she got to see your self-worth before she involves herself with you. You know what I'm saying? And she's always consulting her spirit guides and her ancestors. You know what I'm saying? This is a person that goes within for guidance. This is a person that goes in for guidance. You know, and, in, and, and you know, your inner uh, goddess will never lead you astray. You know, uh, never lead you astray. Yeah. 
Everybody, she has a target on the head, y'all. Everybody is trying to catch her. You know what I'm saying? Everybody's hunting her down because she's the hot commodity out here. Everybody wants to nab her. Yeah. Everybody wants to court her. Everybody wants to court this feminine. <laughs> she has a pick of the litter. And they are lusting off of her after her. All right, guys. Let's see what the universe has to say about my Virgo. What does the universe have to say about what's going on out here in the ethos for my Virgo? I hope y'all doing well. I hope everybody out there is looking good and feeling good and acting right, pockets tight, because that's the way they like to rock it over here on Journeys with the Narcissist, okay? All right, guys. <coughs> Don't forget, to, guys, to follow me on TikTok. Um, I break down words on TikTok. I also do the... Um, Zodiac sign readings there too. But I also break down words on um, TikTok. I call it decoding the spells. I'm trying to tell you a story, guys. You know what I'm saying? For those who can hear and those who can see, I'm trying to tell you a story. I'm trying to tell you her story about what happened to us. Okay? So I'm breaking down these words to decode the spells because these words, this, this language that we're speaking, it has us under a spell. The ladies, okay? And we need to decode them and crack the spell so we can elevate and get back on our throne. So go under my videos and look at the ones decoding the spells and check it out. Like my videos, all right, y'all? I'm trying to tell you something, okay? I'm trying to reach out and touch the people that need to hear this. So come and um, check me out on TikTok and use your magic, your magic with a K, and decode the spells with me, ladies. And let's elevate. All right. All right. We got a feminine here um, that is coming into some type of inheritance. She's coming into a windfall of money. Uh, she may be hitting a jackpot or something. Her palms is probably itching because it's coming through. She's unlocked something in herself that she didn't know that she had. You know what I'm saying? And she has mastered herself. Okay. She has mastered herself. Um, and she knows that love is the way. Love is the key to everything, okay? And she has beautiful dreams, you know, and now her dreams are becoming a reality for her, you know? Um, and she's strategizing um, in her life. She knows that she's going to have to face a lot of darkness, but she's a warrior, and she is here to fight, okay? Um, and someone is in her life um, is very uncomfortable with her being a warrior, uh, her coming into herself. Um, they're uncomfortable and they all in their feelings because they are emotional and they want to be intimate with her. But she's using her intuition with this particular person and she's not dealing with them. Okay. All right, universe. What's going on with Virgo? Okay. Yeah, she's not dealing with them. She's using her intuition with this person. You know, every time you get something good going in your life, people from your past want to come back. You know, these demons want to come back and um, pull you back down on a lower vibration um, so that you won't receive what you're supposed to receive. But like I say, this feminine here, she uses her inner guidance system. You know what I'm saying? And uh, she consults herself, her inner goddess. She goes within. And you know who's within? The divine. You know what I'm saying? She consults the divine and the divine lets her know what's going down. You know what I'm saying? She's tapped into her spirituality. You know what I'm saying? And um, she's using her intuition. And she knows this person is evil. <laughs> a toxic energy. And she don't want to be bothered with him. You know? But she's his target. Yeah. That's what they, this is what this person wants to do. Like I say, every time you write on the brink of something... People want to come around and bring you down to a low vibration. You know what I'm saying? This is what they want to do. They want to play mind games, manipulation, lie, and cheat. You know what I'm saying? They want to get in her head to stop her from thinking clearly, to keep her from moving and progressing ahead, for getting that blessing that she's supposed to get. This is what they want to do to her. They want to damage her and keep her loaded down. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, this is an evil person. All right, guys. All right, guys. Give me a few seconds. Let me get the download and check out the cards, and I will definitely break the message down for my Virgos. Give me a few seconds, guys.
All right, guys, we got this woman, we got this divine feminine here that everybody's lusting out for, off of. I mean, she put her, uh, you know what I'm saying, she was grinding, you know what I'm saying? She put her head down and she was grinding, you know what I'm saying? She put her work in, um, um, she worked hard on accomplishing a goal that she wanted to accomplish, and now it's paying off for her. Um, she's... Um, uh, upgraded her quality of life. She's in a, a beautiful environment that she has created for herself. You know what I'm saying? Um, um, you know, um, she's um, financially secure now. Um, she she don't want for anything. And, um, you know, she, she sowed her seeds and now she's enjoying her life, the fruits of her labor. And here this water sign come. He's so immature and so sexual. He just want to hump on her. He want to get her in the bed so bad. He want to hump on her, boy. He, the things he want to do to her. You know what I'm saying? Um, this could be a Libra. You know what I'm saying? This divine feminine could be a Libra that he wants to hump on. You know what I'm saying? And when he want to do this, he feel that this is justice for him. You know what I'm saying? And then he, and then he, he can come and, and uh, get her in the bed and just screw her half to death. That he can be a part of this Ace of Pentacles. This new business opportunity and money opportunity that this feminine is coming into. But she ended it with, with this person. She's not dealing with him because he's a snake. He's been exposed. You know what I'm saying? He's sitting over there trying to figure out how he can... Um, uh, get her to come back to him, you know, how he can bind her to him because he wants a happy family with her. And now he's paranoid and can't sleep at night because the union that he wants with her is not going to happen. She's not going to be in a union with him, and it's the end of this cycle. You know what I'm saying? So as he's over there, he casting the spells on her, you know what I'm saying, binding spells on her to keep her trapped because he's going through a lot of things in his life. You know what I'm saying? He's juggling a lot of things in his life. Uh, he's going through it over there, you know what I'm saying? And uh, he's juggling his finances, you know what I'm saying? His money is funny, you know what I'm saying? So he won't sneak away uh, from what Whatever you got going on and get in a partnership with this feminine because she's financially secure, you know, but this person is non-committal and he just want to come over there and gaslight her and sex her, you know what I'm saying? So he could probably use her for resources and then he going to go on about his business. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, she's a target for him and a, a whole lot of other men, you know what I'm saying, that uh, wants to use this feminine for uh, financial gain. You know, like I said, she got some men or women that uh, actually want to be the one for her and treat her right. But then she got these wolves out here, you know, because she's a beautiful woman. She has this youthful energy. You know, he, they, they just want her for sex. You know what I'm saying? You know, but she learned her lesson. You know what I'm saying? She learned a lesson. She's not going to be bothered with this masculine. It's the end of this for her because he's a snake, okay? See, this is the narcissist, y'all. And this is the journey that this feminine is going through with this particular narcissist, okay? This divine feminine is uh, going through, uh, um, he's putting binding spells and stuff on her. You know what I'm saying? Um, <laughs> because... Uh, he don't want her to move on. You know what I'm saying? And he don't want to, uh, he wants to load her down. He wants to, uh, manipulate her, uh, mental, uh, so he won't have to juggle his finances no more. It's all about finances for this jackass. And she's not going to be bothered with me out. You know what I'm saying? Be careful, divine feminists, because, uh, they out here being with these hoes, and these hoes ain't got no talents, no gifts, no nothing. And she gives nothing to them. They don't fulfill them in no type of way. And they want to come and take advantage of the divine feminine, because the divine feminine has the creative energy you know what i'm saying she has the energy of manifestation see everybody don't have that privilege you know what i'm saying let me get one of these a couple of these cards over here everybody don't have that privilege and so this masculine this narcissist is using uh, spells to try to trap this feminine because she's in her virgo energy and she's keeping her legs closed you know, and he feel that he got the magic stick, you know what I'm saying, and if he can just get her in bed, that he could just screw her crazy, and that she's gonna, uh, give him part of her ace of pentacles, you know, oh, gigolo ass, uh, person, you know what I'm saying, trying to be, you know what I'm saying, I mean, it's sad, it's sad that these men wanna rule the planet, but, uh, they wanna, 
exploit women for their gifts. You know what I'm saying? But they want to say that they're better than women. Okay, if you're better than women, why you got your name from a woman and your game from a woman? Okay? Everything began and it's going to end with a woman. You best believe that, ladies. So we need to elevate and not be bothered with these type of men. You know what I'm saying? So we can rule this planet. You know what I'm saying? Um, because Mother Earth, she's pissed at us. You know what I'm saying? She's pissed at us. And it's time for us to get right. You know what I'm saying? And we don't need to deal with these narcissists. Be careful, ladies. Be careful. Love yourself. Don't look outside yourself. Uh... Don't look for anybody on the external uh, for acceptance. You accept yourself, you know, because narcissists only deal with uh, women that have low self-esteem and no confidence. You know, they're predators, and they prey on women like that. So we got to be strong and confident and courageous, you know what I'm saying? Um, have our sacral chakra and solar plexus, you know what I'm saying, on point. You know what I'm saying? And... uh Use our intuition and discernment, ladies, you know. You ain't got to be bothered with this mess from these narcissists because, trust me, they are not worth it. Not at all. You know what I'm saying? This person is a waste of time, sweetheart. This person is a waste of time. You got good things coming your way. You know, learn your lesson. And this is destiny is at hand and it's divine time and it's happening for you. You know what I'm saying? You keep your lids closed because he don't deserve it. You know what I'm saying? This bastard is over there having financial trouble and everything is going on in his life because he's a piece of shit. Okay? He's going through karma. You know what I'm saying? And is your karma as good for you as it is for me? You know what I'm saying? Sit back and eat some popcorn and enjoy the uh, the show of uh, feminine. You know what I'm saying? Don't worry. You are protected. You know what I'm saying? Always consult your inner guidance system. That is the goddess within and your soul family. And you got this on lock. Okay? All right. I love all y'all. And if you feel anybody could benefit from this video, please send it to them. Because they need to see examples of self-love conquering these damn narcissists. Okay? All right. So this is another journey that a feminine is going through with a narcissist, guys. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's ridiculous. But we're going to end this. We're going to end this. And we're going to elevate, ladies. All right? I love all of y'all. And as I always end it. Please know thyself, know thyself, know thyself. Until my next video, y'all be easy. Bye-bye.